Hey guys, it's me Gigi and in today's video I'm gonna show you how did I do this look using my favorite drugstore brand. So first of all I like to put some concealers all over my face where I do have my redness and my pimples. And then I'm going with this P. Louise Base Rumor number 2 shade on my eyelid. If it's about eyeshadow nails then this product this is a game changer. Then I'm gonna use this short blender brush from Essence. And I'm just gonna spread the Pillow's base all around my lip, going close to my hairline. You also want to make sure that you have more or less the same amount of product all around your skin for the colors to sit in it nicely. Yeah, that was my baby also helping me a lot here. I don't know what you want. Yeah, and then just blend it in. And I'm gonna use this brush from Maybelline to blend it in and then the color is going to be the Carnival Lisa Profile from Be Perfect and I will use the color named Reckless. And then I'm just gonna put a little tape on my eye because I want that liner part to be sharp as hell. And then I'm just gonna use the Maybelline brush I mentioned you guys before and I'm just gonna slightly blend it into my eyelid. I'm gonna focus on the part around the tape that's getting enough products on it. Then to make it even sharper and more clean, I'm just gonna use this flat, flat angled brush into my inner corner. Then I go exactly at the same area where you should usually do your liner. Then I follow my crease going closer and closer to my inner corner nice and slowly i put less and less products then again the other side of the brush i'm just gonna blend them into each other it's all about going over and over and just blend it and then a bit more products at the liner because i want them to really be like the strongest part and then just gonna remove the tape a little extra just gonna wipe it off with my finger and then sharpen the ends with the same brush I used to blend out the peelers base and again I'm just using the peelers base then I blend the inner corner to make it more look more natural I use the same angled brush and sharpen it kind of making or creating a triangle shape then I do the same with the lower lash line and then I'm just gonna use the same brushes we use all the time and then blend it out very nicely, bring down the color a bit more lighter. And then I'm gonna use this other the Nature Cosmetic Volume Mascara. I really like this mascara because it gives me a very natural look. It doesn't make my eyelashes so sticky. But also when I need to remove it, I don't need to scrub the crap out of my eyeball. So yeah, I really like it. I think it's one of my favorite. And then with the Abelene Eyebrow Pencil, I'm just gonna use the brush part and uh, create this fluffy eyebrow shape using also my got to be hair styling gel and then with my finger just tapping it against my skin to flatten them out since i'm satisfied i'm just gonna double check if they are symmetrical then i put on my favorite lashes from shashu then i'm gonna match my ghost skin with my neck and the rest of my body using this essence foundation and my favorite buffer brush from Zoeva 204 honestly I don't know what the magic this brush does with me but it just blends the foundation into my skin so beautifully and evenly it's, it's just mind-blowing so yeah I'm gonna make sure that the product is all over nicely and evenly covering everything my ears under my neck because with foundation it's number one rule that you cannot stop at your jawline because then you're gonna look ridiculous and then i'm gonna go with the nyx three steps to sculpt again sculpt and then with the zoeva brush i'm gonna blend the darker color into my underneath my cheekbones bring it closer to my lips and nose i like to have it more like oh that brush was beautiful so i like to have uh, this darker color more like from my ears going to the direction of my mouth but not exactly to my mouth but somehow somewhere between my nose and my mouth then i'm just gonna blend my potato nose because uh, nobody likes a potato nose and i want to have my nose nice and sharp and snatched 
So I'm just gonna slightly blend the same dark color through my nose, then I'm going with a brighter one underneath my eye. Then I'm gonna use the Jeffree Star brush and I'm just gonna tap some highlighter all around the area so I like to highlight it's more like at the corner of my eyes, in the middle of my cheekbones. Yeah, I don't like to use blush, I'm just not a blush girl. Then the top of my nose, the middle of it, and then yeah, here she comes. And now we're just gonna cover up these pale lips using the NYX Liquid Cream lipsticks. The darker shade I always put in the corner and then the brighter one into the middle. And this is the finished look, we are done. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please make sure to subscribe to my channel, give a thumbs up to this video if you liked it. And I will see you in my next one. And thanks for watching. Bye bye!